So, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to X Guards of Humanity 21X. And today, we're doing a follow up to the last one we did of this ranking from worst to best of Mortal Kombat games. This time around, we're doing the same thing like we did last time for the game, you know, with the original Game Boy. Now, this time, we're doing it with Game Boy Advance cartridges now. So, we're, we're doing the Game Boy Advance versions of Mortal Kombat. We're ranked from worst to best. So,. With no further ado, let's get to the, the ranking. So yeah, so obviously the, there's only three games, so they're not going to expect this video to be you know, very long. But we're going to start with the last place being Mortal Kombat Advance. Mortal Kombat Advance. Okay, this is somebody that, okay, I just got this game, let's say, two years ago, at, le at least two years ago. And um, I remember playing this. I was really, really not in, interested in... I wouldn't say I was interested in this game. I was wanting to play this for a long time. But when I found out this game was very bad, when a lot of people were saying this game was horrible, and I had to see... I had to get the game to see how bad it really was. And I played it. It's just that. It's very bad. Like, the frame rates... It's just too, too sluggish, so slow. It makes you want to, want, want to just throw, just take this cartridge and... Throw in the garbage. So, yeah. So this is how bad this game is. This is not the great experience for, a, especially for a handheld at the time. So yeah, the worst one obviously has to be this one, Mortal Kombat Advance. So number two will have to be, because I was very debating which one would be the second place. Is either we, you know, Deadly Alliance or Tournament Edition. So obviously we're gonna choose this one. Obviously, being the second place winner, Mortal Kombat Deadly Alliance. Deadly Alliance. This game, I remember way back in the day. Well, this was also on GameCube, PS2, Xbox at the time. So basically, I remember playing this game, and I, I the Game Boy Advance specifically. It was okay. I'm not gonna say it's a bad game because it's it was so it's so enjoyable. I still play it to this day. Don't get me wrong. I still play this. To this day, when I have the time to actually sit down and play this game. Okay, so I'm not saying the game's bad, but there is some audio popping sometimes when you're fighting your opponents in the game. So you're gonna expect it for all the other ports because it's because of limitations, obviously. So yeah, being the second place for me, it has to be Deadly Alliance. So in the first place we all have to talk about is the updated version of you know Mortal Kombat Deadly Lines. That is Mortal Kombat Tournament Edition. Tournament Edition. Okay, the funny story about this one, because I remember getting this like I think it was like last year or so. Because this game, I remember asking my dad for it. I didn't want him to pay seventy dollars just for this cartridge. This is what it came in, which is with the cartridge. It was a loose copy of you know, Mortal Kombat uh, Tournament Edition for 70 bucks. I was like, what the heck? I, is this game, like, let me just say this right now. Is this game worth $70 as the loose cartridge? I wouldn't think so, but I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. I just find, I just find it very weird that they're charging $70 for this game. That's I remember. It's like $69.99. Like, the new, like, prices for the new games, like, for PS5 or Xbox Series X and few of Nintendo Switch games, but yeah, I didn't know this game was that rare, but at least I got it, that, that, that's why now we're doing this video, I know it took a while for me to do this, because I was still wanting to get, play these, I know where I want to rank these, and this list, so yeah, so being first place, what has to be Tournament Edition, so yeah, so anyway, there's not that much to go over, because it's only these games, like three games. So, unlike the Game Boy, the original Game Boy had four, this one has three. I wanted to do a DS one, but unfortunately we can't do that because it's only one game. So, it's going to make it kind of not enjoyable, to, in my opinion, because there's nothing special about the, the Ultimate, Ultimate Mortal Kombat. Overall, it's a great game, but it's not going to be on, on a ranking list because it's only one Mortal Kombat game on the DS. So... So we're going to have to pass that one. So yeah, so anyway, if you like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and also there'll be more to come shortly. Thanks for watching.